art speaks to you in a level that it's, it's an universal language. So I understood that very early on, but just to bring it outside in that scale, it, it requires a lot of work. It's not that simple, oh, I make my little painting, put it in a wall, put it in a show, have my wine, I'm, I'm done. To create that in a community is at a whole different scale. We started to fall in love with the spray paint game and we started to fall in love with giant, huge art and being outside and painting these things and having the community come through and talk to us and speak to them and see how it felt, how it made them feel, which was beautiful. I think these murals can immortalize a moment in time. The Julian Keene mural, we kind of break down the colors and from a distance it looks very realistic, but up front it collaborates almost to an abstract type of feel. Julian's my son, who's an amazing person. He was someone that helped out in the community to anyone and everyone. We really put a lot of love into this design. We really wanted to focus on all the aspects in, of what he's achieved and, um, you know, to give the town a beautiful, you know, mural. Came up here every night and watched him paint, <laughs> especially me because I love art and I love to draw and stuff and just, it was just amazing what they could do with just paint and spray paint and it was just, it was, it was more than we ever thought it would be. It was perfect. It was, it was meant to be. They were the ones that were meant to be here to do this for us. One of the magical aspects of art, especially public art, is how art can bring people together.